So welcome to day two of my fishing trip to Port Elizabeth. On day two, we decided to head on to St. Francis Point. I was very eager to fish these waters. As you can see, it's an absolutely beautiful stretch of coastline. We decided to fish from midday, fishing into the afternoon. Um, stay tuned and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Alright guys, so we've just stopped in Human's Door at a place called First Choice. We have a little ritual. You have to get a butterscotch ice cream before you eat St. Francis. That guarantees you a bronzy. So the plan is have a butterscotch ice cream and then head to St. Francis and catch a nice bronzy. Alright, so we're hoping we made it. We literally just made it in time. The doors are closed right now. So hopefully today is our lucky day and we're going to go tight later. Stay tuned. Point. This is Otter's Landing where we park the vehicles and as you can see we've all loaded up. Luke's already made it, making his way towards the point. Um, we're all loaded up with the gear and we're going to make the 1k walk up over the dunes to the point. I'm really excited. It's my first trip to St. Francis. Uh, Bronson has been kind enough to make the trip with me all the way here. It was quite a drive. I'm really excited. It's such an amazing spot. You really have to be here to experience it. Uh, so we're looking forward to it. Bronson promises us we're going we're gonna to sweat today on the rocks so I'm looking forward to it. Let's hit the road. Stay tuned. Yeah. Got the first Anya for the session, whole mackerel. Okay, Janae. First one for the day. I'm really excited. What do you think it is? Probably a small hammer, I think. I don't know. All right. Yeah. So that's bite number two at St. Francis. <laughs> After landing the hound on the first throw, the second fish that we hooked into was a much better fish. Um, once we saw the dorsal fin on the surface, we realized it was a nice hammer. Um, once we landed it, we gave it a quick measurement, which came in at 1.19. Uh, it was a smooth head hammer. I think it equates to plus minus to 22 to 23 kilo mark. It was absolutely beautif beautiful fish. We took some quick picks and we released her safely back into the ocean. So we just landed a beautiful hammer. That was on a uh, full mackerel. We're just gonna get the hook out and get a quick measurement. Thanks to Luke. What's up? What's up, Bronson. Clear the leader for me, please. Clear the leader for me, please. The hook is out, eh? Out. Yeah. Yep. Just left the leader out of the way, please. Okay, we're gonna start going. Absolutely. That's fine. I'll hold it. I'll hold it up. Because these things go preserved from the rocks. Okay. Today's well done. Awesome. Okay, Thanks. We've got a size of hammer here. Absolute slob of a hammer here. Which Janae just got. Second fish for the day. Yeah, beautiful awesome, fish. Awesome, awesome. Absolutely beautiful fish. I'm so chuffed. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
Okay. Get our run. Um, Just push her. Oh, wait, 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 sir. I'm going to put it in the water. Yeah, right? go on. Oh, yeah. Right. Do you want to. <laughs> wait a minute. Can we start at the side of the Can we get an update there? <laughs> well, looks like it's a paley. Right, bring it, net, uh, net again, eh? We're so saving energy. <laughs> Throw very left. So the next fish that we hooked into was probably one of the top two fish that I came to PE to get was a black ray. This fish was absolutely stubborn. It has so much of power when it's in the water. I would say it's very similar to the thorn tails that we get up in KZN. Uh, I was just so excited to be hooked into this fish. Unfortunately, after a good so couple of minutes and making me sweat in the rocks, um, we did lose the fish. Uh, but it was just so worthwhile just experiencing the fight, having Bronson there with me and Luke guiding me and trying to get this fish closer so we could possibly land it. But looks like this one got away. Standing boy! Pull, 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 pull! Real quickly down, real quickly down. You need, to, you need to pull as hard as you can with these ones. Yes, I do. Check a mullet. That's crazy. Yeah, I'll check. It's good. That's insane. How does it feel to hang with a paley? Nice, nice, eh? Compared to your honey so far? <laughs> yo, yo, yo. Bending, boys. Proper fish. St. Francis at its best. Big black guy. So keep it tuned, guys. Oh, this might be a reggie. Okay. There we go. So, we're on with fish number four. Four for the day. Four, three. There's another pickup. <laughs> go, 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 go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh, screaming real. Oh, dude, what is this? Hold you. Double up. Double up. Oh, it's on. That's number two. Mm -hmm. Second swear word for the day. Okay, so then we're going to have to get you to the front, eh? Hey, what did you go with? A hammer, maybe, eh? A big hammer. Big hammer. Dado was a bronzy. Fish number four, guys. Coming in nicely. Check all the mullet on the surface here. Yeah, take it. Yeah, take it. Thank you. 
So the guys really did such an awesome job handling this fish in the shallows. You can see they have tons of experience with fish. Um, they made sure they tried to keep the stress levels as low as possible. We were really blessed with it. such a beautiful raggy. It was a female with measured 2.01. So the estimated weight on that would be plus minus about 155 kilos. I was really so excited. It was my first raggy and it was actually quite, quite a big one. So it was awesome. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, man. Is he on? A raggy bite is really so much of fun to experience. It takes so much of patience and just waiting for the right moment to strike the fish. After missing the double up, this was in the next cast, so we were sure to take our time and let the fish eat properly and swim away before we set the hooks. Yes, sir. swimming in, eh?
Pull, 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 pull. It's a big male. One on three. One on three male. Is it? We really had such an awesome trip to St. Francis. We landed a lot of fish and we lost a lot more, but it definitely makes for a day that I'll never forget.